My name is Jillian and you're watching Jillian Camps Arizona and today we're going to be doing a little unboxing of this 2.5 inch SATA hard drive enclosure. Severant. I bought this off of Amazon because I was really frustrated with my current enclosure which I will do a things I hate video I'm certain on because this thing is such a piece of junk. I've only owned it for one year and already as soon as you tap it it disconnects from the computer as soon as you just like look at it you look at it the wrong way uh you, you insult its mother or whatever it just disconnects from your computer almost immediately and i hate this thing so much i went out and bought another hard drive enclosure this one by Sabrent. I've actually owned Sabrent quite a lot uh, in the past. I have one of their hard drive swap. Uh, it's just a little tool where you can connect a hard drive outside of an enclosure to just quickly diagnose any problems. So I was really happy to just go ahead and purchase this for about $12 from Amazon. So right now we're going to go ahead and open it up for the first time. And that way we can sw swap out my hard drive from my old piece of crap. Boy, they really took it in there good, huh? Sheesh! Oh boy, I'm gonna have to cut this. <laughs> okay. Okay. So that's everything in the box. I see I, I had to rip it a little bit. Sorry. I'm gonna tuck this under my leg because um, the wind's pretty strong right now. So, uh, this is the way it's packaged. You get the hard drive enclosure right here, the most exciting part, and the USB 3.0. What I like about the USB 3.0 is the way they did it is that it's dual ended. So on my old one, you can just have, this is the connector that goes to the hard drive and then this is the connector that goes to your computer. But this one, they're both USB 3.0. So I really like that feature. And it comes with a little instructions, but pff, we are men. No, I'm not a man. Well, we are technology savvy and we don't need no stinking instructions in that right. So Sabrin has you covered. Extend your two-year warranty. All right, we don't need that either. So I'm going to shove this back in the box. So the most exciting part are these. It's got this little plasticky thing on it. I'm just going to take that out. Ooh, I like it so much better already. It's got an on-off button too for your hard drive, as you can see there. See, on and off. And it looks like it's got a little light too for uh, flashy, flashy when you have when you put your hard drive in and it's reading from it or doing something exciting. Why it okay, so for in order to open this, uh, it looks like it's not going to be too difficult. You just kind of slide it out or something. We didn't read the instructions. We don't need those. But anyways, how about a tool less one? So basically, you should not need to use any screwdriver or anything in order to put the hard drive in or to get the hard drive out. So tool less. Oh, here we go. That was actually easier than I thought. So it just slides out just like we thought, and it lifts. And oh look, it comes with a little foam pad and. That's what this one is missing. So that's probably why I'm having so many problems to hold it in. And actually you can see here, it's got a mini foam in the back too to hold the hard drive in place. See, that's what this one's missing. What a piece of junk. So I will be so glad to switch to this, to this more sophisticated one. So let's go ahead and do that now. So here's my old hard drive enclosure. It's just a slide box. And to just slide it out, you have to be very gentle. I'm not using any tools, just my hands, but my hands are very clean and everything's all very nice and nice. So you just have to be very careful because this actually contains all of my photos and videos. So this is actually what I'm editing this video on right now, if you ever see it. If you don't see it in the future, then you know that something went wrong with this installation, but I assume everything's gonna be okay. So you just slide this in the new enclosure, push it in. And look, it fits perfectly behind that little foam pad. I don't know if you can see that there. It's this little black foam pad. Um, and then you just put this thing on top here and this slides closed. I really like this enclosure a lot already because it seems to be more secure in there. And it's got a fun on off button too. So you know if it's on or off. So I just wanted to bring it in closer a little bit so that you can see the hard drive a little better. So. Uh, let's open it up again and as you can see there's a little foam pad on the inside and then this is what I was trying to show you earlier so you can kind of see this little black foam piece right there uh, and that kind of keeps the hard drive 
kind of mounted pretty well. So not that you'd want to jiggle around a hard drive too much in an external enclosure anyways, but still it allows you kind of better stability. And then what I do is I just, I kind of laid this foam pad here right on the top. And then I just kind of close the whole thing up. And then that is it. That's how you install the hard drive. And as you can see here, here's the light. It's probably blue because Sabrent is a blue. It's got blue as a color for the company and that's kind of their shindig. They put blue on everything. So it's probably a blue light that lights up. And then it's got the Sabrent logo and everything here on the back. And then here is what I was trying to show you earlier. It's got the USB 3.0 input. It doesn't have a special input or anything. And then here is just the on off switch. So I'm really excited to use this and I think it's going to work a lot better for video editing and whatnot. So this is going to be very exciting to use. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And if you're not currently subscribed, please subscribe to me via YouTube or please like my page on Facebook under Jillian Camps Arizona. Uh, it really appreciate it and it really helped me out a lot. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. So I'm gonna make sure that doesn't blow away. All right, pause. How's it going?